Hello everyone, and me and War Clover are back in Ark Survival Evolved on our own private server. Well, so it would seem. Recently, there has been a, uh, well, you know, the Master Trader, which was kind of weird. We didn't, we have no idea who he is, but we decided not to kind of mess with him. Because, as you know, he's like level 105. I mean, we're level 93, but I mean, er, not 93, uh... Or actually, yeah, 93. Anyways, I had an- This is what I have to say about the Master Trader. Look at me. I'm looking. <laughs> Anyways, um... Uh, so basically, I had an encounter with him while I wasn't recording. He gave us... Well, you'll find out later in the video, but anyways... As you can see, there's an addition on the house. We left off with this, like, technological advancement. Me and Warrior Clover also went to the snow online. See, as you can have. Uh, I'm in. Mean, I really mammoth. Yeah. We're probably going to feature that later. And we also did a Halloween episode, which never got published. Fun fact, like, around 20% 20 per, 20 of the episodes never get published for this ARC server. Um, yeah, as, so back to the base upgrade. Yeah, so. This whole area. We did this if offline. We can figure it out. We did this offline. If we can figure it out. We're gonna try and build some irrigation up here. Yeah. I think I can figure it out. But anyways, most importantly, we have to go downstairs, which we have to go through the main house. So anyways, this is kind of like a refinery area. We land in like a flyer in here. They have all the metal. So this is like- And this our is, good friend. This is the docking is bay. Oh yeah, Kermit the Jester. Our right, good friend. Nicholas the Jester? When do you tame him? Yeah. I don't know when you're building this and uh, what we do is like if we're building something momentous like this We just tell the other person not to come in and I just tamed a bunch of dodos for our army of does And there's Nikolaus the jester just to replace Kermit because Kermit is a shifty person Yeah, and he's, and he's managed to escape the boat He's getting kind of old as well. We grow weary of his uh antics So anyways, yes. here's this is a lot of storage in here it's again like a refining area. Maybe we'll put like a smithy here as I think we have a ton of metal unless we like ran out Let's see here. Oh, we still got a ton of silica pearls. <gasps> we do but we have like barely any metal 52 of 291 and 101 still uncooked But apparently our metal is kind of scarce these days so no, there's two uh, 91 in this refining forge. I know. That's kind of weird. It's kind of scary though. Good. But anyways, as okay. I was saying, I had an arky egg. Anyways, I had an encounter with the master trader, and look, we tamed a pretzel, or we we tamed, we tamed a quetzal, not a pretzel, Pre but his name is Pretzel Vendor. Um, so we tamed this quetzal. Let's just say five hours of our time is now uh gone and, and i shot the bird a couple of times so you know went down for a while but look in the process x-wing became the most op bird ever look at this look at his stats or look at her stats jeez that's crazy dude i think we could do with more health yeah and i'm not sure if it got uploaded but we tamed some fresh dire bears. Oh See, no, this, say this, hello. This one was, uh, they already know that we tamed the dire bears. But we also tamed, oh, yeah. uh, a Bronto, which we hopefully will build a giant base on. But for now. During gonna... the Halloween episode. Yeah, we tamed it during the Halloween episode. Hence the name Spooky Bronto. It is <laughs> Spooky Bronto. So, anyways, Pretzel Vendor requires more stuff on on him so like we need to create like a whole base on top of this guy the question is should we make i think we should make it out of wood don't you think so mm -hmm. so now I, I have a question is this the pleasure cruise or the um, warbird mm. i'd say for now it's like a kind of yeah because minerals this won't be a warbird because at this current period of time, none of our friends are on the server, so we don't really need to go to war with anyone. But so like it's for crafting and crap. Yeah, so th this will be like transportation bird and stuff. So I guess like a um, kind of like a cruise ship. 
But that X-Wing is more or less the, the Warbird. I mean, this thing's a monster. And Regal Eagle uh, is pretty good. Not as X-Wing. Well, actually, you know, Regal Eagle might be better. TIE Fighter, not so much. TIE Fighter. What about the Batmobile? Actually, TIE Fighter, let's just do your health. The Batmobile? Ah, uh, yes, the Batmobile. Uh, th this is all natural coloring, by the way. The Batmobile came in this fancy black color. It's awesome, isn't so, it, though? The name is appropriate. Yeah. Batmobile, the Batmobile. Uh, has some rust on it, as you can see, the orange spots. Yeah. So, I mean, we got some rust on it, but the Batmobile can run forever, too. It has infinite juice. We don't have to stop at a gas station for this baby. I don't think Bruce Wayne has to either, but you know. He probably owns a gas station inside Wayne Manor. Yeah. Anyways, we need to lay out the foundation, so we kind of need to haul back a bunch of loads and stuff. Yeah. And guess what? Since Ark put, like, the... You can kind of frick with the settings with, like, how, how much you can put on a platform. We put it at like a thousand. So we can have like a thousand structures on this baby. It's gonna be epic. So yeah, we'll see you when all the foundations lay out. All right, so we are back. And as you can see, we have a really big structure built up for the bird. This is insane, dude. So basically what you did, you might think, well, how did they do this? Are they modding? No, we're not modding. Basically what we did is we placed these foundations out after we placed roofs, and then we placed the foundations under them, demolished the roofs, so then it technically counts as a structure. So yeah. Warrior Clover found it on some video, tip video for art. So yeah. Yes. We can't take credit for the idea. But yeah, so that's that's how it goes. It's pretty much how it is these days. Anyways. So just, you can see that uh, we have obviously crafted up the foundations and we have crafted up kind of like a little structure. And this is not the Warbird, obviously. But as you can see here, I have a ton of things in this box ready to go to build up. And so does Warrior Clover. So we're gonna get building our own basic area. And I'm gonna put the bird up in the sky because it's surprisingly, it's actually easier to build on the bird when it's in the sky. And the amazing thing about the Quetzal, so you can see here, it doesn't drain stamina as it's in the sky. So we can technically float here forever, even though- You can just have a floating city. Yeah, you can have a floating city in Ark, but we're not gonna do that because of obvious reasons. Once you take one bird out, the whole floating city would be destroyed. That's why, like, I don't, I mean, the idea of a floating arc city would be cool, but, like, if you have to get back to the mainland, it's, like, it's unethical. Because, I mean, you need resources on the mainland. That's, like, the main reason you build on the mainland instead of it.
All right, so we're back. And everything's finished yeah. up. So we'll, uh... Put this... Should we do our yours put first? This... No, we have to put them up in the sky. Oh, yes. All right. Go, 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 go. Did you fall off? Oh, I thought you, thought you fell off. I guess that was an unethical way of the suit. Okay, so we're heading up. No. I don't get why Ark has like a, um, why it has like a kind of sky barrier. I feel like it should go on like a long time, like Minecraft. Yeah, and it would be cool if um, like instead of the ocean barrier, it like wrapped around. Yeah, that'd be awesome. But like, I see why they have an ocean barrier because it's like they they don't want to anim or they don't want to kind of program it all. But theoretically, they could just have like just ocean dunes just go all the way out there. Anyways, yeah. Enough complaining. So you want to do yours first? Yes. The clo as you can see, the clover and cool letters. The clover. The clover. Oh, what the? What? Oh, I got rid of all the other ones. Uh, uh, I don't know why that's like that. Yeah, that's weird. Oh, uh, probably because of this epic canvas over here. <laughs> My, and now we can take a sit meet together. We have to do this now. Do you understand me? Now! Uh. And then we come back. Yeah. Sleeping over a warm map. Okay. That makes and sense. All my storages. Mm -hmm. If I'm like, Captain, there's enemies out there. And I'm like, Yay! I shoot them. Okay, wait, now let me, let me shoot out something. Okay, well, that was my only arrow. It's my like Captain America crossbow. And get a view, beautiful view of wherever we are. That's, these two chairs. Oh, that's awesome. Or cook a first glass clover meal in the clover cook pot. And, or the clover ordering fest. <laughs> the fridge where you can hold some meats if you get hungry. And if you want to bring a companion up in the sky yes. and they're getting a bit rabby, we lock them in this cage. So like, while... Also for like, oh no, we need bullets. Just pop them in here. While we're on like metal runs too, we can have these cooking on the way back. Yeah. Yeah, that's a smart idea. Like, a, we take the bird and then we both have, have both of our RGs on it and then... Yeah. Okay, so... Come back and put them all on here. Mm -hmm. So should now we take our catwalks? Yes. We're going to start walk. with the first floor. The second floor is way better. Now let's take... Okay. Then we can take the catwalk over, back over to my side. Yeah. No. Okay. I don't know why I just did that. I had a burp and it suppressed. Alright, entering the, your cat wound. Gaming so things, cat. Eat. So it's like... This is... Yeah, it's like- it's, Is this for the bird? Yeah, this is for like, if we need to feed the bird, it's like, it's running low, it's like ah! And then, um, so yeah, and then we just put some meat, we just pop some meat into here. And yeah, this, makes sense, doesn't it? This is for when you get too rowdy, you have to be locked in here, mm -hmm. and incapacitated. And this is like Many a storage box. This is a public storage area. You can store anything in here. Public storage area. So yeah, that's for now you and around. me. And now upstairs, which is, in my opinion, the cooler part. Ah, uh, I sus- Yeah, this is cooler. I suspected as much. War drums? Yeah. War that's drums! Why I didn't put mine in my room, because I knew you were gonna do this. Yeah. Well, um... Uh, I, I don't think that's the only addition that makes this room cool. We have, like, the meeting area for the- This is, like, the war room. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, I'm right, getting- I'm gentlemen. getting- I don't know, I'm getting Halo kind of, like, vibes from, like, this sky area. I don't know why. So, as you can see, we have, like, our nice bench area that we can look out on the sky. Which is epic. Oh ho! <laughs> Alright, so now let's take the catwalk back. 
This is the best this is part. Just a catwalk. All right, so this is just a safety hazard, though. So every everyone's seen me fly the bird, but how about you fly the bird while I walk around? Okay. You ready? Yep. All right. Whoa, that's so obtrusive. I know. But it's so cool. So this is what she's it... actually plants on this. I know. Okay. Yeah. This is what this is what it's like to fly bird style. This is Whoa. what it's like to an arc airplane, I guess you could say. Holy shit! I phased out. Ah! Oh, there we go. On the way. Okay. All right, I'm I'm good. I think. Grab the ladder. Grab the ladder. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> okay, I'm back. All right, I'm back. All right, so that. Nah, 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 nah. That's gonna be a problem. But I can build. We can work around that. As you can see, Warrior Clover's ramp or ladder's placed way better. Of course, when you jump, you phase onto the roof. But yeah. So, uh, stop it. Stop it. Ah! Oh. Oh. Alright, so, um, I guess we can close out the episode on the most epic view. I guess, Wait. arguably. That's up to the fans but, to hold decide. On. I might be able to do something special. Yeah. Yes. Two. Bird on the smith. All right. There this you go. is how we will end the there episode. There you go. Grab it. Grab it before it flies face the phases through the floor. All right. Thought you put it on the smith. Sorry. It's fine. Here. All right. So we'll jump off from the catwalk. Oh. Uh, All right. We should probably whistle the bird to follow us. Okay. Well, thank you for joining me on this episode. It's gonna be a bit of a long one. I'll make I'll make pretzel follow us, and we shall see you in the next one. Jump! Woo! Parachute activated. Goodbye.